Hey my friends, welcome to Porch Ponderings in the backyard porch. And once this, most of you have already seen, I broke my foot. I broke it real good. There's the cast. All the way, all the way up to my lovely knees. And it hurts. Yesterday was really, really bad. I'm doing it without painkillers. Well, I'll say I'm doing it without pharmaceutical painkillers. I don't believe in them. I never even let them give me a needle at the at the hospital. I had zero painkillers until five hours after the accident. By that time I got home, I had some of this. Cheers. Some of this. An edible pill I tried to lie down the pain was too high but definitely when the edibles kicked in a couple hours later I had an okay evening what am I pondering about I'm pondering about how the heck I get my days done walking around on crutches and in this kind of pain as if I didn't have enough pain to begin with now I got this, but I'm not going to let it get me down, friends. I'm not. I mean, life is life. you got to take the bull by the horns. you got to accept what comes at you and find a way to make it work for you in a positive way. I'm doing that, like, for instance, this happened because I was running beside my son while trying to teach him to ride his bike. Dumb me. I was wearing sandals. Not something you wear when you're running. And I was running. And he went to fall over one way. I went to adjust and the, the lip of my shoe went under and then over went my foot. And I broke a bone near the, between the pinky toe and the instep right through. I heard it. I heard it snap. My boy was wonderful. He was incredible. He helped me. He called his brother on my phone and got him to come and pick me up and take me to the hospital. I have since been doing everything I can to make sure that he understands that he was the true hero there. That dad was silly. You know, it's a, it's a learning lesson. It, it's something for me, but it's also something for him. To know how important it is the right footwear the right safety wear when doing something i was a safety expert at cp rail i should have known better in fact i think i i think i in the back of my head knew this was wrong and i'm kicking myself now because it's really really silly now i've got to take extra medicine i i mean it a lot of extra medicine and it ain't going here going there yeah I got purple almost got pink wanted to have a little fun you got to have a little fun out of life's crazy moments you know uh, I'm in a lot of pain today but it's a warmer day than before so I'm gonna sit out here even though it's difficult I don't do these videos with my son listening so my little boy and my big boy are inside waiting for me to be done my video and then they're going to come out here and they're going to dribble and play basketball. You know, I got my basketball hoop right there for him. And play basketball and enjoy the morning while I watch them and try my best to stay awake for a little while. I'm going to spend most of Sunday sleeping. He goes home to his mother in about an hour. And then I'm just going to sit back on the couch with my foot up and try to let it heal. So, my friends, peace and cheers, love and harmony. Give me some more ponderings. I'll still do them, but certainly there won't be any walkabouts, not for, not for a few days or even a few weeks. I don't know how long I keep this. Not yet. Got to get x-ray done again. Excuse me in two weeks, see if it's healing. Peace and cheers, friends. Love and harmony.